this thing on the wheel head. Um, all right, so I did not cut, I didn't cut this loose. So this is still perfectly centered from the other day, right? So I'm gonna take one of my small loop tools. First thing I'm gonna do before I do anything else is I'm gonna trim that top while it's still pretty well sent, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm choked up on my loop tool. I've got both my hands kind of touching the clay. I'm super duper stable. And what we want to do is we want to trim about half of it down so we have a shoulder for our lid to fit in. And we want to leave a pretty solid thick lip here. If we trim too far over and make this really thin, it's going to be super brittle. It's going to break real easy. It's going to be all jacked up. So I'm going to cut my ridge in. Okay, so now that I have my ridge cut in, I was kind of lazy. I didn't pull this thing as thin as what I should have the other day. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back. I'm going to trim some of that weight out. And I'm actually, I'm going to trim a little bit of kind of some texture and stuff in the side. Because like that one that I made first hour, it's kind of got a nice little shape to it. It's pretty clean. So I just carved a collar in the top and just kind of left the way it was, right? With this one, we've got this kind of tall, plain form. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to carve a stripe in the middle, and so to do that, I just take my loop tool, I'll carve away a little material on the top, go on the bottom, and do the same thing. All this extra clay I'm carving out and getting rid of. And then that's going to make it so that my pot does not weigh 45 pounds and enough. So take my big loop tool to smooth out all those little ridges. Now I'll take this guy. So now I have my jar, right? I've still got to flip it. I've still got to trim the bottom, but you guys know how to do that, so we're not going to talk about that. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our calipers, and we're going to clean all the junk off the bottom here so we can get a good measurement. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the little feety side here, and you're going to slide it in, flare it so it just very gently touches your sides. So now that and this are the same measurement. So now I can pop this off, I can take my lid, so now I take my needle tool, and guesstimate, put a little mark, mark. All right, now, I want my lid to fit perfect, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go just a little bit too big. Too big, you can always trim it smaller to fit. Once it's too small, you are screwed. You have to make a whole new lid. So I'm gonna set my needle tool here. I'm gonna start my wheel. And I'm going to very slowly, you don't just stab through, very slowly, you just score through that clay. Get rid of that. Okay, now I'm gonna clean these burrs up on the top and the bottom. Now, before I cut this loose, I'm gonna test it. All right, it is just a touch too big, which is actually what I planned on. So I'm gonna throw it back on the wheel and I'm gonna fine tune it. And for that, I'm just gonna take my loop tool and I'm just gonna shave just a little bit off. Now, when you start trimming, it's real easy to get crazy and get carried away and cut too much off, a little bit. If you've got to test this thing 14 times, that's okay. All right, so a little bit off. Let me have that. <laughs> My project, I destroyed it on accident. That's okay, we're gonna make another one next week. This week was, this week was, uh, this is a, this is a hard lesson to learn. You got a lot of different things you're putting together that all have to work just right. Also, we had a day and a half off and dry times got messed up and shrink rates are all 
messed up and nothing cooperated this week. Yeah, my other one got fried. Oh, All right, a little Somebody more on. took my first one. I was so mad. It was so good. Someone stole it? Yeah. All know. right, that so. That happens like all the time. They just take my stuff out the cabinet. That one. Oops. So now I'm going to take my needle tool. I'm going to tuck it up underneath. Very slowly, just like the sides. I'm going to trim up into that stump. Okay, so now you're going to clean up a little bit. Oh, boy. Yeah, got to live. So you're going to let me add that? Easy, right? <laughs> That's my participation grade. <laughs> All right, so I want you guys to practice this week. Do the best job you can. If it's a total train wreck, that's okay. Like I said, it was a messed up week. Shrink rates are all jacked up. Practice, if you throw it away at the end of the day, I don't care. Next week, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna have a full week, and we're gonna do them right. Is that good? Yep. All right.